hello everyone how to solve this problem for the values of m if we have square root of m inside the square root of 2 is equals to 4 and we solve this problem for the values of m so here first we find all the roots of this equation and at the last we will check that which of these roots are solution and which of these roots are uh, extraneous root of this equation uh, so uh, at the last i can just explain the term extraneous root so please watch this video uh, at the end now here the very first thing we are going to do is first we need to eliminate this square root sign from left hand side uh, for this we need to take a squaring on both of the sides of this equation after taking squaring it will be written as uh, square root of m into square root of 2 is equals to 4 and its whole square so we just apply the square sign on both of the sides uh, and further in the next step you see here this 2 and this square root are gone and we get here m times of square root of 2 is equals to this is 4 square and 4 square is equals to 16 and, and now further uh, you see here again we have this is the square root term uh, so here we again apply uh, scaling on both of the sides so when again we take scaling it will be written as in this form so in the left hand side we apply here uh, the nice square identity so we can apply this square separately on both of these values and after taking uh, these terms separately here uh, it will be written as in this form and we know that uh, the square root the square of 16 is equal to 256 so in the left hand side you see here we have this is m square times this 2 and this square root are gone and we get here 2 is equal to 256 so further in the next step uh, we move this 2 to the right hand side for this we just divide both of the sides by 2 and you see here this 2 and this 2 are gone and we will get here m square is equals to these are cancelled out by each other and we get 2 1s are 2 2 2s are 4 and 2 8s are 16 so here we get 128 so here our target is to find the values of m uh, so for this we need to, to remove this square sign for this we will take a square root on both of the sides and you know that when we take square root on both of the sides we will write here the plus minus sign of any one of the sides so this two and this square root are gone and we get here our m is equal to plus minus we break this 128 as 64 times of 2 we know that 64 times of 2 becomes 128 and now uh, we expand the square root of 64 we know that square root of 64 equals to 8 times of square root of 2 so here we will get there are two roots of the given equation uh, and now uh, in the next steps we need to verify that which one of the roots are uh, solution of the given equation and which root are extraneous root okay so for verification uh, of the roots we first need to copy down given question statement here it is uh, square root of m times of square root of 2 is equals to 4 and now we uh, substitute uh, the above uh, both roots uh, on the left hand side of this equation so here we can just substitute uh, the positive value it is 8 times of square root of 2 and in this side we verify the negative root it is minus 8 times of square root of 2 and and now here uh, first we verify this value so we substitute this value into the left hand side of the above equation after substituting this we will get here 8 times of square root of 2 this is the value of m and here we have again square root of 2 and we check that is this equals to 4 or not and now you see here we have square root of 2 multiplied by square root of 2 is equals to 2 only and here we check that is this equals to 4 or not and here we have a times of 2 becomes 16 square root is equals to 4 
and here you clearly see that square root of 16 is equals to 4 equals to 4 this shows that the value of m is equals to 8 times of square root of 2 is satisfied over this given question statement now, so this is the our uh, one solution of the given equation okay this is the first uh, solution of the given equation so uh, in the next step we need to verify the second value of m uh, so here we substitute this value of m here this is a negative value when we put it here it will become minus 8 times of square root of 2 this is the value of m and again we have square root of 2 is equals to 4 so uh, in the next step you see here uh, we have square root of minus 8 and square root of 2 multiplied by square root of 2 is equals to 2 only and this is equals to 4 or not this is the our claim and we have minus 8 times of 2 becomes here minus 16 and its whole square root and we check that is this equals to 4 or not so here we can separate this square root sign and we know that square root of 16 is equals to 4 into square root of minus 1 uh, and we check that is this equals to 4 or not and further in the next step we have this will really becomes 4 times of minus 1 square root is equals to iota and this is equals to 4 so this sh uh, this shows that both of the sides are not equal now this means that and the value of m is equals to minus 8 is not satisfied our given question statement so we will just say that m is equals to minus 8 times of square root of 2 be the uh, extraneous uh, root of the given equation okay and uh, you very well uh, know about the extraneous roots the roots that is not satisfied our given question statement is called the extraneous roots and the root that is satisfied our given question statement is called the solution of the given equation so m equals to a time of square root of 2 be the solution and uh, this value be the uh, extraneous root and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos